wrestling has more than one royal family. A lot of, excuse me, there's a lot of people who have come up that weren't good in the big company. And they maybe were bigger in the smaller company, but dude, not every, not every, AJ Styles didn't come up in a big company. So it's like, you know, some people got to come up in a smaller company because the big company has a perception of a, <laughs> I have a wrestler and AJ Styles could have been a jobber. You know, guys like that, if they if they just stuck with what WWE thought was really good of them, a lot of them probably wouldn't really be shit or they would just be WWE rejects. So uh, it, it, it's it's a be damn if you do be damn if you don't kind of thing no no I, you know i'm sorry but i you know just because it, it's no different than what wcw was before it really <clears throat> became the number one thing <clears throat> with the outsiders and everybody it was that it was considered just that that lower tier company that was underneath wwe back in even back in the 80s no, nah, dude, and Penelope, Penelope said that Hall and Nash going to WCW was the best run of all time. And it was the best run of all time, man, because you never saw shit like, you never saw anything like that. That's what made that so impactful. But at the same time, man, I I don't think he's 100% right um, that guys just can't cut it out in WWE. <clears throat> we all know how Vince was. Let's not Let's not disregard that, okay? I, 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 we can never disregard how Vince McMahon viewed wrestlers and what he thought was the get was was the the get over, and and, and like come on man like we, we we can't just disregard that. A lot of people didn't have it. A lot of people had the talent. They just didn't fit. They weren't what he liked at the moment. Yeah. 